I just love fireworks. <coughs> oh, get away. This is my moment. <laughs> <laughs> what are you waiting for? Get inside and finish the job! <laughs> now that we're inside Pinata Central, we can use simple hacking techniques to steal the Pinata files. Soon I will know the location and weaknesses of every Pinata on the island! Then I can capture every one of those papery critters until I am the Pinata King of the World! <laughs> You incompetent code monkey! I have pinata to capture! Delete all files. Press any key to confirm. Yeah, what just happened? You did what? No! Pinata Central is out of action until the records are restored. And in the meantime, I'll make sure those papery pinheads never reach the Canadata. Victory is mine! Hi, I'm Lee Foss, and I'm going to help you get started. Look for this. It can show up anywhere, but it always tries to tell you where to go and what to do next. Pretty little piñata has smelled the flowers in your garden and has come closer to investigate. attracted a worm the wor you have a new bespotty visitor it's come into the garden because you have...
You are doing very well. A serpent has appeared because you've grown some grass. to fill the candiosity meter of one of your piñatas. Feeding helps. Congratulations! You've completed the first challenge by successfully attracting a bisbody into your garden, filling it up with candy, and sending it off to a party. That... a piñata that likes the feel of sand between its toes. You can only find the geki in the desert region. Pinata can only be found out in the harsh desert environment.
Hello again. Selling traps is my sideline. That's got a lucky feel. I can tell. It's not enough to put down a trap and hope something will walk into it. Put some bait on the trap to lure the piñata. Different species like different things, so choose wisely. Return to the main garden and visit the post office to unpack your trap. other Xbox Live Gardeners? Well done! You attract... appeared. They like to investigate a garden.
I don't know how you can wait to open these things. You have a new sweet old visitor. Congratulations on catching this little... You've leveled up. You fill the petals around the clock, which means you've taken a step closer to becoming a truly great gardener. All kinds of things happen when you become a better gardener. Castellot store has opened. You can buy some paving, some fences, a couple of items to decorate your garden with, and some seeds. Seedos will have some new seeds in his pouch too. Everyone, you should all know my store's open again. I expect to see you in here very soon. Just bring lots of cash. <laughs> Nobody likes the taste of chocolate coins more than Lottie, I can tell you. I see you've caught a sand critter. Might be just the right time to give you this sand packet. It works just like the grass packets, and you can find it in the same place on the menu, so it should be no problem for you to use. Congratulations! You've attracted a sparrow mint. Sparrow mints can hear a worm wiggling from miles away and will come to take a look. sunshine, the beach party animals appear. This little custation is interested in your garden.
Well done! Your Sweetle has reached full candiosity because you fed it food it likes. Now it's ready to be sent off to its party. Excellent! You've completed the second challenge by trapping a wild piñata, making it a resident, and filling it up with candy to enjoy its papery party! You really seem to be getting the hang of this now. There's one more challenge, and then you can manage without my help. Improved again. Well done. Lottie has some new items in her store, including some garden lighting. Seedos has another seed for you. Use your usual technique to get those out of him. Only eight more levels until the garden size increases. I'm sure people would like Seedos more if he gave away more seeds. You should try to not... Dear Doc, P P Patch here. Where am I needed? I'm r r ready for healing and st st stuff. Make way and g g give me some r room. Let me introduce Seedos. He's obsessed with gathering seeds. You should try talking to him. Thank you. 
Hello, I'm Sita. Sometimes pin... I collect lots of... Ouch! When you hit me... As soon as I mend my mask, you are in serious seedy trouble! Did you see that bunny comb appear? He must be able to smell the carrot in your garden.
Willie Builder here to tell you my shop is now open. Return to the game, press A, and then press X to open the menu. Select the village option. You can open my store by selecting the icon that looks like my head. Congratulations! You have attracted a white flutterscotch. Sometimes they are attracted by the noises of other animals, and sometimes the scent of flowers brings them. Fly. It likes fruit. Any kind will do. Willie here, Master Builder. If you I'll get started when you put down the work shed. Level four already? You really seem to have taken a shine to this gardening lark. Check Lottie's store for some more items to decorate your garden. If you see Seedot, you should talk to him. He has at least two more seeds for you to try. In seven levels time, the garden will get bigger. Here comes trouble. A sour shell.
Welcome to the Romancing Minigame. You need to take control of your piñata and try to reach your partner without hitting any loathers. The loathers are creatures created by Professor Pester and they hate the piñatas being happy. Push the left stick in any direction to make your piñata move and remember, if you hit a loather, you will lose a chance and waste some of your time. If you lose all of your chances, the game is over. Are you ready? As the old saying goes, you can't hurry love. And that's especially true on Piñata Island these days. You'll notice that the object of your affections will be none too pleased if you make your approach before proving your feelings. To do this, you need to collect the required number of love hearts indicated by the meter on the screen. If you search out more heart tokens than you need, then you will receive a chocolate coin bonus for each one collected. Any heart tokens you leave behind will count against your total time. Now you've completed the game, your happy piñatas will go into their house and do a romance dance. All the seeds are mine, but I'm cut. Animals want to romance, but they can't get home. Help them or, or they'll be broken hearted. Pinatas have made an egg. After pinatas have done the romance dance, a new baby pinata is brought to the garden, safely packed in a patterned egg.
Here we are at level five. Doesn't seem like five minutes since you had only just begun. Lottie has some new paving in stock as well as some decorative items to use in the garden. More importantly, she has a watering can upgrade that will save you some time. Make sure you talk to Seedos too. He has a couple of new seeds. Just six levels until your garden size increases. The bad seeds plant themselves quickly. They're tricky ones. Worry no more, your new egg has been delivered safely. Another successful mission for Storkos, the people's champion. I can identify every kind of seed. If I were a little seed... Pinata is hatched in your garden. Your label is fixed to it. You can change your label by using the label designer. Press A to close this alert. Put the cursor on a pinata born in your garden. Bring up the information by pressing Y and then select the label designer icon. Congratulations on romancing your best bodies. You breezed through that. Well, it looks like you have most of the basics. Please visit me for some more challenges. You just need to press X in the garden to bring up the menu, select the village option, and then look for my face. If you help me, I can give you some cool stuff. If it isn't the new gardener in town, you're guaranteed a warm welcome at Costalot's store. Whether you're here to buy or sell... You're buying, huh? I knew we could be friends.
Another level already? <laughs> well, in that case, you should take a look at the new fence, amongst other things, that Lottie is selling. She also has some milk for sale, ideal for growing piñatas. Seedoss has new seeds too. Where does he get them all? After the amount of time you have invested, you can call yourself an experienced gardener. You have attracted an arachnid. Arachnids only visit the gardens of more experienced gardeners like you. Look at how I prevent essential piñatas from ever reaching the garden. My genius knows no bounds. Victory is mine!
Good news! You've attracted a mouse... Just about to have my tea. I'll take a look at your job, then have something to eat, and then I'll be. Before I can start the job. Getting used to leveling up? Okay, this time Bart the Tinker is open. He's important for making stuff that you can't get anywhere else. Lottie has new garden decorations, including a very cool flag. I think Cedos has a new seed too. In four levels time, the garden will get bigger. All right, now we can start for real. I never needed help when I used to run this garden. This shovel gives you the ability to dig deep holes, deep enough for water to gather in. Here comes a raisin. The sweet smell of those buttercups has surely drawn it to the garden.
I've heard that you can eat some seeds. I've heard that... My seeds say that I sh Scratching around. I think that corn you have in the garden is the secret to a cluckles being here. Hello there! 
there, my triangulated circular friend. Can I bring to your attention the arrival of my mobilistic dwelling and the tinkerific tool that lies within? Myself! Please elect to pay me a visit whenever you like, and we can talk some more about the science of turning one item into another. and Cedas has new seats to celebrate. Lottie has new paving and some more items to pep up the garden. Three more levels and you'll have some more space to play with. Toad has turned up. It must have seen you receive a shovel upgrade and thinks you are going to dig a pond. I had a dream where all the sh If you tuck a seed... When my mask...
Watch out for the new Super Loathers. They are coloured blue and are Professor Pester's latest attempt to thwart your piñata's romancing activities. They can move in any direction and will try to chase you down and zap you with their pesky pest power if you get too close. They're also indestructible to boot, so take care. As you romance more of a species, the challenge will become tougher. You'll notice that there are more heart tokens to collect, more hazards and fewer lives. This will continue until you reach the maximum difficulty, which occurs as you are becoming a master romancer. Did you
Want to try your hand at hard landscaping, eh? getting better. Treat yourself to some new items for your garden from Lottie's new stock. Seedos will have some more seeds for you too. In two levels time, your garden will grow larger. Congratulations! You've unlocked the trick stick. Use it to train pinatas to entertain you with amazing feats. Press Y to find out the details. My tip is to feed a sparrowment with a daisy seed. While it's performing, tap it with the trick stick to teach it the trick. Now you won't need to waste any more daisy seeds. <laughs> 